Leadership for Agricultural Transformation Over 1 billion people globally suffer from chronic hunger. Millions of children are afflicted by serious malnutrition. The world continues to face major challenges to achieving food security in the 21st century. Despite a dramatic increase in global food availability and substantial progress in poverty reduction, hunger, food insecurity, and undernourishment remain at unacceptably high levels. When African heads of state and government met in Maputo, Mozambique in July 2003, they endorsed the Comprehensive Africa Agricultural Development Program, CADEP. Aimed at helping African countries achieve at least 6% annual growth in the agricultural sector. After 10 years of implementation, a meeting to take stock took place in June 2014 in Malabo, Equatorial Guinea, where a declaration to sustain its momentum for shared growth in agriculture was adopted. Recent statistics show that Kenya's agricultural sector is growing dismally. At 2.9% in 2013, a decline from the 4.2% in 2012. 10 million Kenyans face various levels of food insecurity at any given time. As a country, we have fought poverty, hunger, and malnutrition through the Millennium Development Goals, specifically since the year 2000. While we have made great strides in meeting the Millennium Development Goals, the battle is far from won. In recent years, Kenya has faced severe food insecurity. Over 10 million people are food insecure, with the majority of them living on food relief. This situation is attributed to several factors, including the frequent droughts in most parts of the country, high costs of domestic food production, displacement of a large number of farmers in the high potential agricultural areas following the 2008 post-election violence, increase in fuel prices, climate change, political instability, and low purchasing power for a large proportion of the population due to high level of poverty. Kenya is formulating and reforming various agricultural policies at national and county levels to facilitate food security and nutrition. Devolution presents many challenges that are not insurmountable. These initiatives bring great expectations, but we have to do more. Strong, decisive leadership is needed to plan and manage change. It must start by building strong and well-managed county organizations with concrete plans and clear roles for government staff. It must develop sound policies and regulations that will permit, not prohibit, the development of agriculture systems. It must include strong partnerships with the private sector and other private players especially to attract badly needed investment in agriculture and agribusiness. Counties must collaborate with one another to facilitate inter-county trade, opening up markets for our farmers' produce. Just as our grandmothers stored their grain in the African pot, so do we store our hopes of growth and development in transformative leadership in agriculture. If we strengthen the agricultural sector in this country, we shall strengthen the entire economy. As a leader, how are you ensuring that our children have access to safe and healthy food? How are you contributing to the fight against poverty, hunger, and malnutrition in our children? Africa Lead 2, a Feed the Future program funded by USAID, supports the advancement of agricultural transformation in Africa in support of CADEP. Africa LEAD contributes to the Feed the Future goals of reduced hunger and poverty by building capacity for innovative leaders in Africa. We understand that better prioritized, designed, measured, and delivered agricultural policies will greatly improve food productivity in Kenya. We believe that strengthened agricultural programs and enterprises in Kenya and Africa will lead to greater agricultural productivity and food security. We strive to ensure learning through our transformative leadership programs by working with individual leaders who champion, lead, and manage policies, structures, and processes needed for transformation of agriculture across the continent. We work to execute agricultural networking and learning projects 
including the Champions for Change leadership training and internship programs. We strengthen key organizations in agricultural policy and programming, including county governments. We facilitate inclusive policy making processes by supporting the cycle of policy making, implementation, review, and continuous learning. Join us as we support the course of feeding the future of Africa through building transformative leaders and institutions.